Dickie's Barbecue Pit is an American family-owned barbecue restaurant chain that started in 1941. Thank you for your suggestion. Okay, dinner time! <laughs> Guys, dinner! It's Dickie's! <laughs> With three locations in Reno, Dickie's brings authentic Texas-style barbecue to the biggest little city, from beef brisket to pulled pork or chicken. Every Dickie's smokes their meat right there in the restaurant. No shortcut to delicious barbecue. Kids eat free on Sundays. Each meal includes free pickles and free ice cream. That's right, free ice cream. What are you waiting for? Get to Dickie's. In 1941, Travis Dickey founded Dickey's Barbecue Pit in Dallas, Texas by opening as a single barbecue stand at the corner of Central Expressway and Knox Henderson at 4610 North Central XB in Dallas. Travis Dickey, who was a World War I veteran, was known as a true Texas character who was blessed with the gift of gab and the love of authentic slow-smoked barbecue. In the beginning, Dickie's Barbecue Pit was a family operation with Travis working the block and Miss Ollie Dickie serving sandwiches. Space on the restaurant's sign was rented out to help pay the startup costs for the restaurant and the menu was limited to beef brisket, pit hams, barbecue beans, potato chips, beer, bottled milk, and sodas. In 1956, Travis passed away and would leave it to his wife and family to carry on. Brothers Roland and Travis Dickey Jr., or TD as he was called, took over the business and in 1967 continued their father's legacy of quality hickory-smoked signature meats, adding more slow-smoked meats and sides. Under the direction of the Dickey brothers, Dickey's Barbecue Pit expanded their menu and then expanded throughout the Dallas-Fort Worth area and quickly became known throughout Texas for their hickory smoked barbecue and popular catered events. In 1969, the chain would open two locations and would end up totaling nine locations by the end of the year. Franchising began in 1994 after loyal guests and barbecue fanatics demanded more locations. Those iconic yellow cups were introduced in 1988. By 1998, the first restaurant outside of Texas would open in Colorado. Roland Dickey Jr. was appointed CEO of the restaurant chain in 2006. By 2010, the company owned seven stores and oversaw another 119 franchisees or owner-operators, as Dickey's calls them, in a total of 22 states. They would call the restaurants not fast food, but fast casual or a quick serve. The Dickies business model continues to call for a careful devotion to the founder's original recipes with flexibility in some geographic areas. The family-oriented company is big on partnering aggressively with local schools, churches, and other community organizations as well. The company at that point was opening stores with little or no debt by decreasing startup costs, asking landlords to put in more money to improve facilities, and focusing more on store conversions. The company would receive widespread acclaim. Technomic named Dickie's Barbecue Pit the fastest growing restaurant chain in the country in 2012. QSR Magazine included Dickie's Barbecue Pit on its list of best franchise deals. Dickie's Barbecue Pit established its Barbecue Boots and Badges Foundation, now the Dickie Foundation, a charity foundation for law enforcement officers and firefighters, in November of 2014. In 2015, the chain would open its 500th location. In 2017, Laura Reed Dickey was named CEO of Dickey's Barbecue Pit. 
She managed under the umbrella of Dickey's Capital Group, the parent company of Dickey's Barbecue Pit brand. In 2018, the company opened its first international location in Abu Dhabi in the United Arab Emirates. It would go on to open international locations in Singapore, Tokyo, Japan, and Canada. Today, the menu features beef brisket, pulled pork, St. Louis style ribs, Polish sausage, spicy cheddar sausage, smoked turkey, and marinated chicken with an extensive array of home style sides from jalapeno beans to macaroni and cheese. Buttery rolls are served with every meal along with a complimentary ice cream. And just like always, kids eat free on Sunday. Dickie's Barbecue Pit still slow smokes all meats on site, just like the way they did in 1941. Today, with more than 650 locations in 44 states, Dickie's is still thriving. So what do you remember about this place? Leave a comment or a suggestion for a future video below. And if you haven't already, hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching. Yeah, bringing back memories from the good old days. Yeah. That's super cool, man.